What, they didn't give me any time? Okay, whatever. Man, Chidori wasn't at the station today. Maybe I should check again. Nah, on second thought. I better stay put. The operation's tonight. Hmm. The operation, huh? When it comes down to it? We're fighting to protect her, too. Wow. Thinking about it like that kind of fires me up. He's gonna be so heartbroken, bro. For sure. Especially when we, if we run into Striga again. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe we really are like heroes of justice. All right. Don't move. Huh? Wait. That voice. See? Oh no. <laughs> Did they just kidnap him? Shadow. So we're not checking up on oh, Chunke. Okay. It's near Polonia Mall, I think. For some reason, I can't quite pinpoint its location. I'm trying to narrow it down, though. Is that part of its power? Sorry, I'm not really sure about that either. We have enough to go on. Amada. Did you find him? No, I can't find Junpei-san anywhere. His backpack isn't here, so I don't think he's been home yet. What is he doing? He knows tonight's a full moon. I'm not picking up his signal anywhere near the dorm either. Should I take more time to look for him, just in case? No, it's okay. You're young. Sometimes you just get in one of those moods. For now, though, we need to focus our attention on the shadow. Can't afford to waste any more time. We need to get moving. I can't believe they're talking about his disappearance. He's just oh, he's young. Oh my god. Let's go. Hold up. Did Junpei say anything about this? Reach it. 
All right, we can split up and search for it. There's no time to lose, so let's hurry. Wait! Please, I can do it! This is what I'm here for! <sighs> Feel the movement of the Earth through your fingertips. Hear the answer of the wind flow through your hair. Taste the knowledge of the water on your lips. Tell me, Lucia, what shrouds me from the truth? Hey, is she okay? Don't break her concentration. This is... some kind of... web... beneath us? A web? Perhaps it's related to the old power cables underground. Back when the island was still being developed, this is where the main power station was located. Underground cables? Yes. A large number of power cables remain underground in a sprawling network, much like a web. So that's what's interfering with her ability? Thank you, I guess. I figured it out now. It's not that the cables are interfering. The cables themselves have been possessed by the shadow. What? What? How? So, everything under our feet is part of the shadow. No wonder you couldn't pinpoint it. It's covering this entire area. H how are we supposed to beat something like that? <sighs> Adding underground, huh? Ow! I can't believe how easy it was to sneak up on you. Is the rest of your team this oblivious? <clears throat> Damn it! I can't fight back like this! This isn't funny, Chidori. I want you to do something for me. I have orders for you to pass along to your team. You can at least communicate with them, can't you? My team? Orders? Do as I say, and you won't be harmed. All you have to do is call off your operation. Easy, right? And not just the one tonight. All of them. You want me to... Cancel the operation. No way. You're not one of them, are you? Quit wasting time. <sighs> so the Shadow controls a whole underground network. This is a problem. We have no means of attack. Your notes from previous battles mentioned a Shadow that was able to take control of the monorail. I'm guessing this shadow must have its own body, just like that one. Let me see if I can pinpoint it. <sighs> Luca. Even if we know where it is, we still have to get to it. If it's abandoned, there may still be a way to enter the facility where the cables converge. We'll see. Is it some sort of basement? Wait a minute. I overheard the manager of Escapade a while back. He was saying the power supply has been acting up lately. There was a big outage because of it that forced him to cancel some important event. An outage? Yeah. Mentioned they remodeled the basement into a control room a while ago. Maybe we should take a look. That's gotta be it! Good job, Yamagishi. All right, as soon as we're ready, we'll make our move. Oh, okay. I gotta set up my team. Yes. Yo, what is that? Actually, actually, that looks cool. Body, so it might use electricity to attack. Please, be careful.
So this is one of those huge shadows. Hmm. Well, not like it changes what we usually do. I'll help too. This large shadows are kind of the hermit. Watch out for attacks that use electricity. That ain't too bad. Electricity? Most of us can handle that. I already know what move we can do, so I'm looking at my uh, first attempt at this boss. I, I got to the very end, but then we all got team wiped by the supercharge. So, so, so we can cut that part out because we don't we don't need to watch all that. Ikari is a weak to electricity, so we're gonna have to put on her. What? It wasn't enough? Just 
situation.
faster! Do it! some hidden potential. I can't sense it anymore. Nice work, everyone. Oh, by the way, I think I sensed Junpei Kun earlier. He's back at the dorm, but something felt off. The chairman's there, too, so he should be okay, but we should hurry back. Just in case. Hmm. It looks like they've completed their operation. What? You can tell? I see it. Through Medea's eyes. Medea? My friend. I was about to say that your persona, but no, never mind. Why didn't you call off the operation? Is your mission worth your life? Dying is what people fear the most, is it not? Well, I have never actually given anyone orders before. They wouldn't listen to me, even if I tried. You see, uh, I'm not really the one in charge. So, you were lying earlier? Why? I don't understand. Hey. Can you tell me one thing? Was it all just an act? Hmm? The way we met at the station, that cut on your hand, the drawings. Were you just setting me up? Now that I think about it, a real cut wouldn't have disappeared that fast. <laughs> I see how it is. That was... Junpei! They're back already? An evoker? She's a persona user? Medea, come. Oh, it was a persona. Alright, I was right. What's all the fuss of... What? When did she... I guess, restrain her. Understood. Uh, Medea! I... I didn't even sense her until now. This is the only thing I can do, and yet... Even we couldn't sense her. She must have the ability to conceal her presence. I certainly didn't have the slightest clue she was here. I have a number of questions for you. Are you a member of that group called Strega? Uh, I'm not... afraid... of dying. Shidori? Medea, I'm... <sighs> it looks like she's too emotionally unstable for an interrogation. Let's check in on her later, after she's had some time to calm down. I'll go ahead and arrange a hospital room for her. She'll have to be placed under watch, but I'm sure she understands. Shidori. Yo, I feel bad for Junpei. I'll ask you one more time. Is Chidori your real name? 
What kind of organization is Strega? Are there others besides you three? <sighs> hey! Hey, Junpei! You're not supposed to be here, remember? Junori! Junpei! <sighs> Sorry. He wouldn't stop asking about where she was. How are you feeling? Looks like you calmed down now. <sighs> she certainly has. In fact, she won't say a word. Maybe we should confiscate her sketchbook, too. Come on, you don't have to go that far. Taking that away isn't gonna make her talk. I'm not so sure. She was quite upset when we took her evoker. Speaking of which, where did you get your hands on that? Ajia. Didn't I tell you not to bring that up? What else am I supposed to do? I'll have someone else try next time. Why? Why did you take her from me? Dia. Takeba, call a nurse. We're done for today. I'll let Ikutsuki san know we're having difficulties. Oh, okay. Come on, Junpei. Let's go. Shidori. What happened to you? Oh, well, after all that, we're just gonna... Wait, hold on. Good morning. The hospital notified us earlier that her condition has to be stabilized. Now, I think and I was had a questioning her, you should go to your... Whatever, I can't read. I should get new weapons for the crew. <sighs> Pathetic. Obliged. Good to see you. What's your bro? Wanna sell in bulk? All right, I'll take that. <laughs> yeah. Creating equipment. We have some new items prepared. Come take a look. Whoa. Wait, this thing is awesome. I want this. This, right? Did you change your mind? Is that all you need? Come again.
Okay, so... Hmm... Hello. Kids don't have much money, do they? At least, I never gave much to my son. <laughs> I am not struggling. It's like, you have to, you have to emphasize it. Kind of it's you <laughs> see, you just gotta let them know we're not broke. I don't like your roundabout way of talking. It's a yes or a no. Speak clearly. By the way, let me ask you. Is there anything you want right now? And I mean something you can buy with money, not some crap like love or a sense of humor. <laughs> that was a stupid question, I should have guessed. Materialistic desire can lead to aspiration. Still. When you get to be my age, Try thinking about it this way. You work to make money so you can have a better life. But to make enough money, you gotta work all the time. So you never get to enjoy that better life you're working so hard to have. Quite a paradox, isn't it? Do you know what the average lifetime income of a white-collar worker is? Including a retirement fund and an annual pension. It's 250 million yen. That's not even close to a lottery jackpot. Thanks to me, you learned something new today, eh, huh, kid? Now, don't waste your life working all the time trying to get rich. Just take life as it comes. Morning. Yeah. For sure. Okay, we can continue to the Kari social link. Definitely gonna do that.